I am gonna show you exactly how to expose those that are tracking you and then show you a new way to browse the web where you still get to keep your privacy. This is a normal website, right? With back to school and back to college laptop deals. So why are there over 72 trackers on the site? So let's say you're casually searching the web and you're browsing for things like how to modify your car to go faster. Seems innocent enough, right? Well, do you really think this has zero value for your car's insurance company? Do you really think that your life insurance policy company wouldn't want to know about these things? Data collection today is not what it used to be. It's not just about selling you more stuff. Today's data collection has far deeper implications. Now you may say, look, you're good because you can't be tracked because you delete your cookies and you always use a VPN. And that is actually uh, not true. Whilst that might help protect your data in some capacity, data collectors are much smarter than that, which is why they use browser fingerprinting and that is very different to a cookie. I mean, look at it this way. Think of a cookie like an air tag or a tile tracker. As long as it's attached to your keys, you can track your keys. But the moment you remove that tracker from your keyring, then the tracker is basically useless. This is where fingerprinting comes into play. Think of your car. It's a certain make, it's a certain model, it has a specific color, style, number of doors, and a specific number plate. When you see all those things together, you know this is your car. So when you drive around in it, it will identify as you. Fingerprinting online is the same thing. It's a collection of bits and info from your browser that when put together will identify you. Whilst it's by no means perfect, it's pretty darn close to keep tabs on you as you bounce around from website to website. Even a VPN won't protect you against browser fingerprinting as that just masks your IP address, but the rest of the browser variables remain the same. Want to see your own browser's fingerprint? Check this out. Head over to miunique.org and then click on view my browser's fingerprint you will be able to see a whole bunch of individual items that all together make up uh, you. Now, even if you block your cookies or delete them, your fingerprints will still identify your browser. So who is using this kind of tech right now to track you? Let's expose them. Head over to this website down here to disconnect.me forward slash disconnect, then click on get disconnect and add that as a Chrome extension. So let me show you this in action. Okay, so keep your eye on that D that we've just installed, that Chrome extension. Let's open up a regular website and check this out. I'm actually going to click the button to unblock the tracking site just so you can see exactly how many trackers are actually tracking you every time you go to this innocent looking website who's all about the best headphones you can buy. 99 plus that is just a ridiculous amount here they are you can click on each one of them and just see exactly which broker has your information seriously that is just not okay so this is where neva.com comes into play who are actually today's sponsors neva has also had enough of that loss of privacy and how invasive all this is and that is why neva is actually changing the search game you see, Neva is the world's first ad-free private search engine. And unlike other so-called privacy search engines, it actually doesn't sell your info because it doesn't show ads or rely on ads to make money or even collect your data. When you run a search on Neva, you just get beautiful results from reputable sources. No more ads at the top, no more scrolling down just to find the three or four pages you were actually looking for, and no more skewed results either. And none of this is being tracked. With Neva, you can also search apps that you connect to it, like your email, your docs, your calendar. So it's a one-stop shop to run all your searches. And yes, before you ask, they still can't read your private info, so it's still 100% private. But it gets even better. You can personalize your search experience. If you like a specific shopping site or a specific news outlet, you can tell Neva that you wanna see more from that company. Conversely, if you don't like a service or a website, you can tell Neva just to show you less from them. Neva is absolutely heavenly for those of us who are searching for products and reviews. With Neva, you don't get these low quality sites that just make their money by pushing you to use their affiliate links. Neva actually gives you info from trusted sources. And again, you can customize it. Okay, so why is this all free? Well, 
you can use Neva right now for free and there is even a Neva Premium, which is a paid for version. You see, Neva is all about privacy. So in the premium version, you get a lot more customization and you get LastPass Premium for your password management and you get Bitdefender Premium VPN as part of that deal. Now that's awesome value. I have a link in the description where you get one month of the premium version for absolutely free. And look, when you work it out on a monthly basis, Neva Premium is less than the price of one cappuccino per month for all this privacy. And whilst you guys are stepping up your online security, did you see that gadget that can disable your security's cameras? Check it out right over here or check out this video over here that YouTube thinks you should watch. Hit the head down here to subscribe and I'll see you in this video or this video, or I'll see you in both. Let's go.